Welcome to Yorkshire. We are travelling up here for Nanny's funeral, but Mum's been up here since like January, so we're doing a little day trip. It is editing Emmy. I'm coming in to say that I'm putting this video <clears throat> I'm putting this video in anyway because from this point on the it, we kind of go to chaos for about another four weeks and this kind of shows how it started and well, what oh, still playing down here and what the trigger was and for me the trigger was nanny dying and the traveling and then once we got back it took me a fair few once we got back from Yorkshire we went straight to Windsor from Windsor I had Covid from Windsor then we went we came back home and I think it took me about another week to get into a routine where we were back in the flow but hopefully you can see a bit of difference in my face from the videos that you're watching now and we do get back on track but I'll tell you the rest of that story when the next sorts of videos come out in a few weeks. We, we went for a drink in a, in a pub slash Indian slash, I don't know, it was quite strange. Yeah, <laughs> and it, all got a bit weird. it all got stranger because mum found a picture on the wall of some people sat on this bench with these things in the background and we decided to replicate it. This is our lives. <laughs> we walked up two flights of stairs and ended up in this like whole building full of crafts and things. Such a beautiful in here. We just went to the bakery. We ended up with a sausage roll. Mum's got a pasty, Mike's waiting for a sandwich. But the woman was really scary. <laughs> so Mike went in and said um, she thought she was serving me. Then he obviously I was and talking to I was talking to them like across the way. And Mike came down and said, Can I have this sandwich? And she was like What? <laughs> so then we were scared to order anything else. <laughs> Come all the way up to the top of the hill by the mast. I'm going to the three acres. Chicken liver parfait to start, a nice glass of white. Roast dinners, we're waiting on the bed. It's really nice. I never thought I'd like brown bread ice cream. Mm -hmm. Good afternoon. What day is it today? I think it's Wednesday, so I think the last time I spoke to you is maybe Sunday. Basically, we're, as you know, up in Yorkshire dealing with um, the funeral of Nanny. My scales were left at the at Lucy's house in Windsor, so I haven't had them since for almost a week now. And obviously being up here is pretty tough with the kind of food that's around like the kitchen's not a full kitchen here so it makes cooking in really difficult and i think the biggest lesson for me this week has been that i need that like daily accountability because if i don't have that daily accountability for me that's getting on the scales if i don't have that daily accountability of getting on the scales every day i just fall off the track completely what i am trying to do is just I mean I haven't been when I say completely fallen off the track I haven't been completely off the track I have been doing eating a lot less than I would have done up here otherwise but I think the last two days have probably been the worst and what I'm trying not to do is tie the emotion to that normally the emotion would have been well you've absolutely failed because you've you've not eaten what you should have done you're worthless you blah 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 I'd gone down that whole route whereas I'm trying to look at it like this is a really challenging week it's Danny's funeral where I'm up with family in Yorkshire which I don't do very often so just do your best and whatever happens happens there's still another what 11 weeks of this so it's not like all is lost based on one week 
I'm going to sign off here for this week and I'll see you back here um, at the weekend. Now, the weekend, we should be back in Windsor, which presents a whole new set of challenges. But I'll have my scales back. I'll be able to start tracking again properly and hopefully that results in a weight loss. It should have been weighing day to day, but it wasn't because I said the scales aren't here. Lucy is coming today, so I'm going to get on in the morning. Here we have it. Here we have the week. I'll see you back here next week for another video. And until then, I hope you have a great week. Would you like to start?